Ahoy there, Captain Goujon here, and welcome back to Outlast, and now I've got a broken Sony video camera with shit batteries. It's all good. It's all going well. Last time we dropped my camera, didn't have my tough case on, and it's just all... everything's fucked. Everything is just fucking fucked. So we're going to continue on into the darkness, because that's a great idea. We may as well just find a closet to hang ourselves in, since inevitably that's probably what's going to happen. But, I am forever the optimist, as all you guys probably know. Huh. So let's get back up here. Come on, climb <laughs> with your two missing fingers. Alright. Oh shit. Sorry. Apologies. So the priest's gone from last time, which is a bit of a shame, because I was kind of hoping we'd get to hang out, spend a bit more time together, and know that I'm not a target because I'm over 21. Actually, sorry, over 13. Do I run and jump? I'm going to run and jump and hope for the best. I'm not going to make it. Never mind. Right. I think I've been overcomplicating this far too much. I think I can just jump up there. Yeah, I can. Fuck me. Talk about overcomplicating shit. Jesus. So there's a hole in the floor. Looks like that's my only option. Great. Nothing bad ever happened from when I went downstairs. Apart from men trying to rape me and murder me. So all good stuff. I was there before, but now I'm here. Incredible. That's how traversing things works. Well, if that's not a sign from Jehovah, I don't know what is. That's not good. Maybe. I can shimmy on over here. It looks like... That... Could be jumpable? I don't know why I would, but fuck it, I'm gonna do it. Batteries? Anyone? Anyone got any batteries? Nope. Wasting my fucking time. Biding my time, which I think is the better term. Right. Here we go. Into, obl <coughs> into oblivion. Well done, dickhead. Jesus. I do hope this floor doesn't collapse when I start. Oh my god. I think I do need to go this way. <laughs> And then, just gently drop down <coughs> to here. That's fine, you see. I'm not... Hi. Are you a nice person or a not very nice person? Only one way out. Only one way. You have problems, don't you? I imagine one of the problems is that your eye is sewn nearly up completely. Okay, bye Stevie Wonder, bye. I'm going to close this door behind me, don't mind me. Just It's nothing on you. You're just ugly as fuck, so I'm gonna keep moving. How do you know you're not a patient? Shut up. I hope I'm not a patient. I'll never get out of here. It's very badly signposted. What is that? It's just a shadow. Jesus Christ. Shitting it. Okay, saving. Which means I'm free? Oh no. Oh no. Um, can I just make a run for that door? Nope. Oh fuck. Well, that ain't good. That's pretty much guaranteed death. Come and get me, you fucker. You ain't got shit, son. Do it. I dare you. Good. Challenge accepted. Fucking run. Taste of freedom. Please don't be closed. Shit, it's closed. That is that is bad news. Hi. I think we uh, we misunderstood each other a little bit there, Mr. Walker. I wasn't running from you. I was running from you. Up, up, up into the vents. Fuck this. Get bent, prick. What are you gonna do? Nothing. Who's a big man now? 
That's right. Me. I'm up here. Can you please stop making that noise? It's rather disgusting. There's a person in here. Hello, fair stranger. That sitting position does not look overly comfortable. Don't roll your eyes at me. It's rude. Holy shit, this is the entrance way. Go on then. Off you pop. Is it safe? What a ridiculous question. Nothing's ever safe. I'm in the library with all these boring books. I ain't reading shit, son. Oh, a file. Yes, I am reading shit. I take it back. I have pressing news concerning the ongoing work of Dr. Rudolf Wernick in his development of the morphogenic engine, expanding on theories developed in his brief but unfortunate relationship with A. Turing. If I had not witnessed it myself, I would have not believed it had happened, but beyond even the promise in cellular regeneration and guided cancer regeneration, I believe Wernick's method have breached the spiritual realm, something crossed from the other side. <gasps> A personal, I personally witnessed the appearance of an apparition, briefly, but undeniably so. Okay, what else are we saying? With regards to your family, that's all I really need to know. I'm going to go through here. Oh, fuck. Yes, I was supposed to tell you, the key to the house of God is in the theatre. Behind the light, in the theatre, behind the light. You have to see the movie, so that's where I left the card. Okay? Okay. I need your help. Where are you? Yes, coming! I'm coming! Yeah, you, you have. I don't know if to trust you or not, because you are a freak. Undeniably a freak. But you were very well spoken in English, and I trust anyone who's English. So, that's not true, but it's true enough. Ugh. Oh. That creepy ass music. Creepy ass music. Don't like it. Not one bit. Gotta turn that off. No, I cannot. Never mind. We'll. shall continue. Okay. Jump down here. Oh, cameras. Please, somebody send help. I'm fucking sick of this. Oh. Hi. If you had a mouth, I bet you have a beautiful singing voice to go along with that piano work. There's a cupboard to hide in. Why? <laughs> Okay, this is pretty unsettling. An entirely empty movie theatre. Man, these guys had it made. They were committed into an asylum, fed, watered, bathed. Given everything. And they had a cinema. Pricks. Right, this is not okay. Oh, fuck. What movie? What are we watching? Well, I hope it's Apocalypse Now. Ah, follow the blood, it said. I shall. Oh, fuck. That's not... That's not great. Ooh, reading. Yes. What we got? Wash those hands regularly. Winky face. Great. <laughs> Solid advice, though. I can't knock his. Uh, can't knock his advice. Pretty good. Wash your dicks, too, guys. Ah, oh, that's where the film is. Oh fuck me! Jesus Christ! That was rather rude. Quite scary. A little bit of wee came out. 
contacted something supernatural. Okay. This supernatural. Let's go through this doorway. Then what was it? You said Project Wallrider. And across this gateway. terrifying gateway ledge. Right, do I need to jump to that balcony or something like an action hero? There we go. Oh, good. I'm gonna close this door. Close that door. Have that key. And that's good. Are you still in this locker? I can hear rather loud footsteps. Oh fuck, there he is. That's what those footsteps were. Fuck it, I'm off. Oh shit, there he is. Oh, it's a rapist. I'd know you anyway. It's the rapist from earlier. I can tell from that shaft. Creepy. But where do I go? I knew I'd have to fucking come this way. Fucking run. I'm out. Fuck this. Is this the key? Yes! Fucking bosh. Get yourself up there, mate. Close that door behind you. Don't want any rapists catching me from behind. Ah, Murkoff. I feel like I'm getting somewhere now. Which is why I'm going to end this... Excuse me. I was just doing my outro. It's very rude. Anyway, I'm going to end this video here. This has been another episode of Outlast, and if you like this shit, like this shit. Share, subscribe, do what you got to do. But until next time, Captain Goujon, out.